You're not going to believe this, but the IRS just made an unprecedented announcement. They're moving fast to protect the American taxpayer from scams from these so-called ERC or employee retention tax credit promoters. If you didn't know, this was the $26,000 tax credit for small businesses who kept employees on payroll during the pandemic. The IRS has essentially halted processing of new ERC claims until 2024. They say this is because of a surge of questionable claims and concerns from tax professionals like myself. Uh-huh. I and many in the industry have been shouting from the rooftops that these ERC promoters are ripping off the American tax system with fraudulent claims. I'll break down what it all means and stick around until the end of the video. I've got a voicemail from Snoop Dogg, courtesy of one of the questionable promoters that you won't want to miss. Stay tuned. Hi, I'm Noel Lorenzana, your YouTube tax man. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. <sighs> so where do I even begin? Maybe you saw my last video where I personally sounded the alarm on the $2 trillion ERC fraud problem that no one was talking about. If not, I'll put a link up here. Let me read some important parts from the IRS news release. Amid rising concerns about a flood of improper employee retention credit claims, the Internal Revenue Service today announced an immediate moratorium through at least the end of the year on processing new claims for the pandemic era relief program. This is to protect honest small business owners from scams. IRS Commissioner Danny Werfel ordered the immediate moratorium beginning today to run through at least December 31st. Following growing concerns inside the tax agency from tax professionals, as well as media reports that a substantial share of new claims from the aging program are ineligible and increasingly putting businesses at financial risk by being pressured and scammed by aggressive promoters and marketing. Here's what that means. The IRS just put a stop on processing new employee retention credit claims until at least the end of the year. Why? Because they're worried about ERC scammers tricking honest businesses into making false claims. This also helps to protect the loss of trillions of dollars due to the huge ERC problem. Well, it's about damn time the tax professionals community has been warning the public and the IRS about the rampant fraud and abuse going on with employee retention tax credits. This is really, really serious. If someone improperly received ERC money or dealt with an ERC promoter, they've got problems and they need to get some professional help sooner rather than later. I'll leave my booking link down below. If you need help, I'll help you if I can or I'll direct you to someone else if I can't. If you are waiting for your ERC claim and it's currently being processed, then you need to understand that processing times will be a lot longer. It was normally 90 days, but now you can expect to wait up until 180 days or even longer, especially if the ERC claim requires additional review or goes for audit. The IRS could also ask for additional information to ensure it's a legitimate claim. If the IRS hasn't started processing your ERC claim, then just know that you probably will fall under the processing moratorium and you're just going to have to wait until the IRS figures out what they're going to do next. But if you do have a legitimate ERC claim, then file it anyway. Because the IRS can only delay processing, they can't eliminate it entirely, especially if you have a legitimate ERC claim. So here's what's going on at the IRS. They've shifted their focus to review questionable claims for ERC tax credits, they're focusing on audit work and criminal investigations on the so-called promoters and the businesses filing the fraudulent claims. The IRS also announced that hundreds of criminal cases are currently being worked on and thousands of ERC claims have been referred out for audit. You know, I've been warning about this for a long time and if you wanna learn more about that, check out my ERC fraud playlist up here. You know the saying, the wheels of justice turn slowly but grind exceedingly fine, which means justice will eventually be served, but it might take time. Here's what the IRS commissioner says about ERC scammers. The IRS is increasingly alarmed about honest small business owners being scammed by unscrupulous actors. 
and we could no longer tolerate growing evidence of questionable claims pouring in. The further we get from the pandemic, the further we see the good intentions of this program being abused. Basically, scammers are out of control and the IRS has finally put their foot down on ERC fraud. This is all very good and well, but it's at least two years too late in my opinion. The IRS should have acted on this much sooner. Agree, disagree, let me know what you think in the comments below. If you're not sure if you've been dealing with an unscrupulous ERC promoter, check out this other video I made up here. It'll help you to know for sure. According to my friend, Michael Sullivan and former IRS agent, he tells me the IRS has only 250 agents nationwide to handle over 1.4 million ERC claims. In this department, the IRS is seriously understaffed and contributes to the inability of the IRS to stop the fraud and abuse. They're hiring a couple thousand new agents, but even that might not be enough. This is an avalanche of work the IRS is facing, and I really don't know how they're gonna handle it all. Invariably, they won't be able to prosecute all of the ERC fraud. Many will fall through the cracks, but the ones that don't, they'll be facing a world of hurt with IRS audits, having to repay ERC money, along with penalties and interest. For many, it'll be financially devastating. If you found the video informative, please do me a favor and hit the like button and consider subscribing for more content like this one. And last but not least, listen to this ERC ad by the one and only Snoop Dogg. Yo, 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 what's cracking? Listen up, fam. It's your boy Snoop Dill Double G back at it again, dropping some more wisdom on y'all. Now I gotta hit you with some real talk. All you business owners who held it down during the pandemic, I got a gem for you. You know, times were wild, and if you had employees, you might be sitting on a refund that's rightfully yours. But check this out. I got a hookup for you. It's called ERCEnroll.com, and they got the game on lock. Now, here's the kicker. These folks at ERCEnroll.com, they got connections like no other. They can have them funds in your hands quicker than you can roll up your favorite. Well, you know what I mean. We're talking just a couple weeks, and boom, you got that cash flowing back where it belongs. So if you're a business owner who's been through the thick of it, don't miss out on this golden opportunity. Slide on over to ERCEnroll.com, let them know Snoop Dogg sent you, and watch the magic happen. It's all about getting what's yours, baby. ERCEnroll.com, they're the real deal, and they got that fast track hookup. Y'all, Snoop Dogg stamp of approval, baby. Peace out. <laughs> that was pretty hilarious. Do check out this other ERC video, which includes never heard before sound bites from someone from the ERC fraud division of the IRS. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.